dinner tonight. Those of you who are so lucky to be invited, let me tell you what we have. Move in here. Simple meal, but uh, a lot of work. This is scallops with uh, a linguine made of cassava, no gluten. And then I made a homemade vegetable broth with uh, celery, carrots, green onions, and nutritional yeast, and rosemary. And here, another one of Mario's pâtés, avocado pâté. It has roasted or toasted smoked uh, onions, and it has uh, olive oil and lime, and then chopped uh, watercress mixed together, and that's the pâté. Then, garçon, one of my favorite Uruguayans. It's with a tanat grape from Uruguay. And tonight, we're going to discuss what is mindfulness. You hear so much about mindfulness and your meditations, and you have to go into all these states of uh, consciousness. Mindfulness is very simple. It's just the awareness of novelty. When you notice something new in your environment, you're right on. That is the mindfulness. You have to train yourself. And our brain works on default mode, which is what guides you when not paying attention. And when you wake up in the morning, your default mode is going to go into, okay, it's a morning, so it's time to think about this, think about that. Stop, take a deep breath, and find novelty around the room. And you get out of that, and gradually you begin to change and become more mindful rather than habitual. You have the habitual process, which is just you get up in the morning, this is what you see, and, and you go to another context, and this is what you do. But if you become aware and you become mindful, which is tuning into the novelty of the moment and doing things in a more creative way, you begin to change that mindlessness that leads most of us. So it takes training. This is why I do the workshops and I have these dinners. So we'll discuss it in more detail with those of you who are here. Enjoy. Bon appétit.